Welcome to another 3 Minute Wednesday, and today we're talking about BMI, Body Mass Index, and how it's a shitty tool to measure your health. BMI is used in many different places like gyms and doctor's offices, but what is it measuring and why is it used so frequently? BMI equals your weight in kilograms divided by your height in meters squared. It doesn't take into anything else in consideration like your genetics, your family history, your age, your activity level, what your eating habits are, nothing. Let me show you just how inadequate BMI is to measure your health. BMI is invented by this Belgian guy whose name I can't pronounce. So last time I checked in the mirror, I'm neither Belgian nor am I white. So BMI, it is not a valid tool, nor is it an inclusive tool to measure people's health across all ethnicities. Let me give you some examples of the inadequacies of this equation. Take me for example, I'm 5'9", I weigh about 145 pounds. On the BMI chart, I am 21, so I'm considered normal. Take The Rock, he is 6'5", 260 pounds, on the BMI chart, he is considered obese. Next, take Matt Frazier. He is current CrossFit champion. He is 5'7", 195 pounds, and he is also considered obese. According to Harvard Medical School, BMI is not a measurement of your health, nor does it indicate an absence or presence of a disease. Life insurance companies actually use these charts to determine your likelihood of reaching an advanced age. So basically you're being judged by something that has nothing to do, is totally irrelevant to your health. As a health professional, what I highly recommend is getting a DEXA scan. A DEXA scan scans your body composition, such as your bone density, your body fat percentage, your muscle mass percentage. It basically gives you a detailed view of your entire body composition. And that's a much better measurement of your health than BMI. So next time you see BMI, tell BMI to beat it because you ain't falling for that shit. Well, this is it for this 3 Minute Wednesday. I hope you enjoyed this video and we'll see you next time.